there's, a, there's 2 billion people or so at the moment who need vision correction in the developing world don't have it. The reason is not just that uh, they don't have much money, it's also that they don't have access to eye care professionals. So the solution that I've devised for this um, uses a, a, a nice little trick whereby you have a lens, you make a lens where the power of the lens can be changed, the focusing power of the lens can be changed by the wearer. Interesting. Now, now I actually have a pair with me right here, Josh, and it looks like there's almost syringes on the side. Can you kind of walk us through how they work exactly? Well, yes, in this particular embodiment, in fact, why don't I just show you how um, this device gets applied in the field. Um, okay, so I need glasses, I don't have them, so I put a pair of of these glasses on. Okay, I'm going to join you. I'm putting mine on too now. Okay, cover up one eye. Chain, turn the knob on the other lens until you've got nice clear vision in the distance. Once you've done it, done one eye, cover up that eye uh, and adjust the other lens until you can see clearly. This is and incredible. I'm doing this with you. Yeah, well, that's, that's really good actually. So, um, uh, do the other eye, and once you've got nice clear vision with both eyes, what you actually do in this embodiment of this eyewear is you take the eyeglasses off, and you do up, with a screwdriver, you do up the little screws on the, I wouldn't suggest that you do this, but you do oh, up Oh, I the, see, on the front here. Yeah, and then, and then you take a pair of scissors, and you cut off the, you chop through the tubes, and you remove the adjusters. And so then you end up, I'll just show you what you end up with. You then end up with a pair of glasses like that. So Josh, what is the liquid that is inside the syringe here? Well, the liquid is a relatively high refractive index silicone fluid. The refractive index, the higher it is, the more light gets bent when it goes into, into the lens. Now, how does it work? Well, what you have is you have a chamber inside the lens with the th thin plastic membranes on either side. And as you pump fluid into the lens, the surface of the lens curves and its curvature changes. You pump it in, the surfaces curve out and the lens gets more positive. If you pump fluid out of the lens, then the surfaces curve in and become more concave. So what you have is a very interesting lens that can go from positive powers, the sort of thing that's used, the sort of lens that's used to enable you to see close up, to negative powers, which are used to a negative power lens, which is used to correct someone that is so-called short-sighted or myopic. What an incredible idea. So the thing that I find amazing is actually this isn't even just an idea. This is actually being used out there in the world right now, right? Oh, yes. The first thing you have to do is actually show that it works. And I have done several experiments where with both adults and most recently with uh, teenagers where we give them um, eyeglasses like this and we get them to run the process that we just looked at earlier. And we see how accurately they can correct their own vision. The answer is that both adults and children can correct their own vision well. And there are now 40,000 or so, perhaps a few more actually, in use in about 20 countries. So obviously having the gift of sight is phenomenal, and I don't know that one should care too much about aesthetics, but how about the design of the glasses? Are you planning on having different designs out there for different face shapes? Yes. Now, one of the things that happens with children is that if you give them eyeglasses, which they need, and they don't like them, uh, research shows that they won't wear them. So you don't just have to make a device that works, you actually have to make it look such that a child will look at it and say, yeah, I'd like to wear that. And that's one of our challenges, and we are, in fact, working on that now. We're making um, uh, aesthetically pleasing um, frames with the same functionality. Well, it's absolutely wonderful work. Thank you so much for this magnificent invention that is changing people's lives. Thank